Hello and welcome again. My name is McDonald's Guy. And today, today we're playing The Walking Dead. Season 1, Chapter 4, Around the Corner. <laughs> We've learned a lot. We've learned, we learned a lot today. Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly! Ugh, I've heard enough out of you! Now, what the fuck's the problem? Oh, yeah. You're not coming with us. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow, if y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. To help find a boat, it's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. Okay, we'll look for them. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! Mm -hmm. Ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need... Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Somebody wants to hurt us. Somebody wants to take Clementine away from us. I don't think so at all. I will not allow it. It's in my nature. Can't I just hold it? Just for a little while? We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. How's O'Neill? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? <laughs> sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. What the hell? Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who the hell is this? Hello? Hello? I said answer me! What the hell was that? 
Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? <laughs> it tolls for thee. Everybody, run! Too close, don't you think? Ben! No! Ben, help her! <laughs> God damn it! up with you thanks Chuck move your asses River Street's right up ahead that's not all <clears throat> I'll give me a fucking break wait where the hell's Chuck <laughs> shit he's in trouble we gotta help him There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go. Goodbye, Chuck. I'll get the door. You okay? Ah. Uh. Yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Okay. I wanna talk to you, motherfucker. Yeah. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck, at least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. I'm going to go check things out. <laughs> all right. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? No, nah, they didn't see us. We were too fast for them. I can still hear them out there. It sounds like they're getting closer. It's just your imagination. I'll feel safer when we're inside the house. How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. <laughs> Try not to worry. It always looks worse than it really is. Except when it's a bite. Yeah, well, it's not a bite. We're gonna get you fixed up. Just get us inside the house, will you? 
I'm on it. Lee? Yeah? Thanks. No problem. Will we be inside soon? Yeah. Not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. It's alright. Uh, you'll be just... Dandy. Just a doghouse. Looks like something was buried here. Okay. Where, oh where, oh where, oh where, oh where? What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Bullshit. Every day's a school day. All right, so where's the dog? <laughs> I know where. This is what I was looking for. Chuck shovel. The shovel is never not useful. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. What's buried down there? Whatever it is, it's been here a while. Ew, I can smell it from here. Gross! Clementine, honey. Come sit with me and O'Neill. Let Lee work. Oh, God, the smell. I can't get it off. Okay, that is not cool. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? <laughs> oh, boy. Nothing. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Mm. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can... Oh. Clem! God damn it, get back here! Clementine! Ta-da! Good work, Clem. But don't go shooting off like that without asking first. Okay? I was just trying to help. I know. And you did good. You just had me worried there for a minute. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. No, 
It's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that, and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever that was on the radio, I think they were trying to help us. They did warn us, didn't they? Maybe you're right. But whoever it was, they're watching us, following us, and they don't want us to know who they are. I can't think of any explanation for that that would make me feel better. Can you? I'm with Kenny on that. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head to the river together. Deal? Suit yourselves, and I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. The place seems secure, at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. Is there anything I can do? Thanks. I got it. Hang out with Chris to know me until I get back, okay? Lee, I'm sorry. What for? Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just ask me first the next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown-ups, okay? Okay. Alright. Let's see if this can work. All I have to do is reach. <laughs> All right, let's check up in here. See if there's any food. All empty. Of course. Wishful thinking, right? Let's see. A dog food. What's in the microwave? No power. <clears throat> That's empty. Walter. Sorry, Walter. Sorry, buddy. All cleaned out. Not even water. Not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. <laughs> Let's check this door. I should finish checking the house before heading back outside. Okay. Must have stopped working a while ago. Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. Might as well take it. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. How's it coming? Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. 
I mean, yeah, that's a big old table after all. <clears throat> Oh, what is that painting of? Not exactly my style. Hey, guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far, so good. How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. What do you guys think about this plan of Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kinney's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. La 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 la. Okay, 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 okay. Open says I. Okay, dramatic. Door opens. Jesus! What? What happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Just the, just the closet. Do 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 Alrighty, let's open this door. Dramatic door opening in three, two, one. All clear in here. Just one more to check. Do, 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 do. I don't know who these people are, but they look. The husband has a really beautiful wife. What is just some saying? <laughs> so, man, I can open it in three, two, one, go. It's the bathroom. That's the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay <laughs> here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. Not yet. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. All right, let's venture forth.
Jimmy? Kenny, you okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh, no. And it looks like Duck, too. like duck, don't he? He was just a kid. What the hell happened to him? 